Welcome everybody to the Hump Day Show. Uh, we are coming at you on this Hump Day. Uh, it's me, uh, Public Enemy Fifty Nine, aka Lowe's. We got uh, Linkster One Hundred One, aka JP, uh, and we are coming at you on this Hump Day to give y'all our most anticipated movies. Our top of, four, top four movies coming out of 2019. 2019. Uh, Cause man, for 2019. I started scrolling through the release dates of, well, all the release uh, dates of all the movies coming out this year. And I was like, damn, this is a banger of a year yeah, we're gonna, about to have. Like, a lot of hits. And, like, right away, too. Cause yeah, hits April, after hits after boom, hits boom, boom, boom. after hits. So I thought, man, let's talk about our, our favorite movies coming out this year, our most anticipated. I'm hoping y'all can tell us y'all most anticipated. Uh, put it on the comments. Let us know. Click subscribe. Um, because I'm, I'm pretty sure for all these bell. movies, we're going to be doing reviews, and, and we would love for y'all to be a part of that. So um, we're going to well, start it off with our number fours. Um, yes, so, yes, So yes. go ahead. What, what you oh, got? I get the privilege. You, get, you go get first. Ladies go right. first. Oh, little slut. <laughs> so uh, my number four movie that I'm really looking forward to, um, it might backfire on me. It might backfire on my ass, but it is... The Lion King. The oh, circle I'm, I'm, surpri I'm surprised you didn't go at Latin with uh, Will Smith's uh, genie. <laughs> no, I have more faith in actual uh, Lion King. So it's supposed to come out July 19th. You are aware that's a cast of mostly uh, African Americans, right? Well, how, does just, that, how does that I'm concern just, me? I'm just, <laughs> how does that concern me? No, I, but I saw Coco and it was nothing but Mexicans. Uh, that's stretching it. That doesn't, doesn't fade me. Anyway... Back on course. The Lion King, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, of course, it's one of the best Disney movies of all time. Uh, I, I want to see how they remake it, how they do it. It I, looks cool. From I what want, I, from the little we've seen, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, and I want to see Scar. Yeah, man. I want to see everybody. I want to see how evil he is. I want to see everybody. And they got some great voice actors. Timon, uh, Pumbaa. They should have got Billy Crystal still as Timon. Nah, nah, nah. They should have got him. But anyway. It's a new age. Let nah, it go. they should have done it. But, um, um... Yeah, so James I'm, Earl Jones is um, uh, yeah, he, he was the original one from yeah, I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's coming back, uh, yeah. which is pretty cool. I, I'm excited about Lion King. When he was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog. Okay, okay, that's enough. That's, yeah, that's enough. enough. That's enough. Um, so, so is it me? Is yeah. it okay? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <coughs> yeah, your turn now. Uh, so my number four is gonna be Captain Marvel. Um, Ooh, and it comes out soon too. It does come out. It comes out soon. next week, I think. Now, no, the week does this come out? It comes is out. Is it? Okay, so. so I guess we're gonna be doing that review soon. Anyways, um, <laughs> couple of things I do have to say. I am cautious about this movie, cause from what I've seen in the trailers, I'm just not a hundred percent convinced on Allison uh, Brie. Um, but they they came out with reviews. Uh, over the street, I don't care about reviews. People are liking it. I no, care no, no, no. Less reviews about are important. Reviews. reviews are important. I don't uh, care. Uh, people man. liked it, and and, and you I know. don't care. I, I need to see it with my own eyes, and I will judge it for that. Now, I'm a little cautious, but I'm hoping that Marvel can pull this movie through because this is gonna lead into you know the next batch of Marvel movies, which I'm really excited about. Um, yeah, everybody's uh, you know uh, excited about so. You know, I'm hoping Marvel keeps their streak going with Captain Marvel. Um, although, man, from the the snippets that I've seen, I don't know. But I'm I'm, I'm super excited for the movie. I can't wait to watch well, it. Well, they're introducing a, a new villain, the Scrolls, and they're introducing a new hero, of course, yeah. it's Captain Marvel. Oh, and uh, 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 Samuel Jackson, younger Samuel Jackson. The effects and all that. I, I really like it. Uh, some things are cool, but man, some things I'm worried about. But we'll see. I'm, I'm excited. It's getting good, good reviews. It's getting reviews. Nonetheless. Well, uh, my number three uh, movie that I want to see this year um, is John Wick 3. So I was a fan of the first one. No one told Woo! me about the first one. I like Keanu Reeves as an actor. Uh, oh, Keanu is a freaking Keanu, Keanu. Keanu Reeves. Keanu. Uh, but anyways, uh, I, I, he, I went to go see the first one, fell in love with it. Saw the second one. It was uh, okay. It wasn't great. It wasn't up to par, but I'm still down to watch the third one. Because uh, John Wick. And, 
Yeah, man, I'm excited for it. Yeah, the second one wasn't on the first one's level. Yeah. But it still holds up. Yeah, and it got Halle Berry. Halle, Halle Berry. Oh, you mean this new one? Yeah, this new one. Has yeah. Halle Berry. Hopefully she comes out like she did in Swordfish. Yeah, go check that out real quick. <laughs> Swordfish. What about the one with uh, Billy? Oh, Billy Bob Thornton. Yeah. Well, he has those ones. Oh, those Monsters, uh, ball. Monsters, Monsters Ball. Monsters Ball. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hope she comes out like that. We'll find All right, that's enough. Halle Berry. Uh, <laughs> uh, Halle, Halle Berry. Halle Berry. But uh, nah, man. John Wick. More action. Actually, the trailer is one of the best trailers I've seen in a while. In I like a while. that people. He has that blue pit. Uh, next woman in the picture. Man, it. it yeah. Badass. First of all, him fighting with the dog. Like, okay, badass. Like, this is what you want from John Wick. The fucking stabbing and fighting with the katanas. Like, oh, come on. That's that's what you want when you watch... Action. John- yeah, action movie. Pre- one of the best action stars right now. Uh, Keanu Reeves bringing in the trailer. Keanu. 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 Uh, I'm really excited about... Uh, uh, John Wick 3. Yeah, uh, I mean, Good too. choice, good choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that was your what? Number My three? Number three. All right. Number so, three. My number three. And I know I might get a lot of shit for this one. Star Wars Episode Boo! 9. Boo! So, uh, this is coming out in December. Trash ass. Now, I understand. Ryan Johnson killed the uh, you know the trilogy so far. Trash yeah, And fuck Ryan Johnson. I hope you uh, I hope you die. Uh, God damn. I hope, but I hope your kids have a lot of the money left over for them. They live a really great life and happy. But I hope you die. Um, but man, Ryan Johnson uh, ruined it. But... But J.J. Abrams is coming back from the ashes to, to fuck it up even to more. reclaim the Star Wars franchise and bring it out of the slums that it's in right now. I believe in J.J. Abrams. I think he can rescue the Star Wars franchise. I know it's been terrible, this trilogy so far, but I think J.J. could come and bring us... It literally it has won't been be, it the won't, worst trilogy of all freaking time. It, it won't be the best trilogy of the Star Wars universe, but it will be the best movie. I feel Star Wars Episode Nine is gonna bring it. It's gonna it's gonna blow everybody's fucking Trash. minds. I cannot wait till December. Trash. JJ, please save us. JJ, please Trash. save us. JJ, that movie's the, that that the um, for me Star Wars is Episode One through Six. Everything else after that is pulled up. Really, Caca. one and three is in there. Uh, one, two, and this three. This trilogy is better than one, two, and three. Now, hell no! Yes. Hey, Anakin Skywalker? Hell no! Yeah! The best, the best lightsaber fight between Obi-Wan Kenobi and Anakin Skywalker? Oh my Skywalker? god, you're talking about that CG Woo! fight where they're jumping on, on, on top hey, of stupid... And using the force. Loading platforms? Using the force, bitch. That's the dumbest shit. Use the force, bitch. No. Yeah. yeah. But anyway. Alright, guys. So, my number two movie that I really want to see this year in 2019. Uh, I saw the first one last year. Which was it one? I'm ready for it two. It so two. I loved it Let's one. Do it. it followed the book so well. Um, of course, there were some parts that were left out. Um, due, yeah. Due to how graphic it was. In what? The novel. Where's the gangbang? <laughs> I want my gangbangs. So in two since, choose. Yeah. Two choose. So essentially, in the book, uh, there is there is a gangbang. If you go ahead and read it, uh, well, it's not really a gangbang. Stop saying that. It's a train. I want two choose. They run a train on. I want two choose. Anyway, like, hey man, show a little bit and just go to black, black the anyway, screen. So I'm excited Before for it. Man. I'm excited for it. I'm, I love the new uh, adult actors that they got to replace the children. I do. I do like they, them. All. They're gonna alternate from the past to the future. Uh, back and forth. Okay, so, so the keep... kids are coming back. Huh? Yes, yes, they are that, coming back. That, that. Uh, but I think it's only going to be for a short moment. They're not going to be too much. But I can't wait to watch it. Uh, Billy Skarsgård is a, such a great actor. Oh. That's it. He did an amazing job. Oh my God, job. he is so good. Definitely dedicated to his role. Uh, uh, did a phenomenal job. He should have won an Oscar just He should have fucking won that shit. He Fuck all won. these uh, motherfuckers winning and awards this... for no fucking did reason. Know, did you know that shit he does with his eyes? Like in the movie, that's actually what he does. Bro, like, bro, no, bro, give he belongs in this role. Give that man, like, and can we please make an Oscar for best villain? Yes. Like, can we just create that, please? But I mean, Fuck. moving forward, of uh, James McElroy, Ma- McAvoy, 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 uh, he's Professor gonna be X, one of the. He's adult. gonna be one of the adults. Uh, also, that nerdy dude from uh, that movie with Amy Fisher, uh, he's in Saturday Night Live. Bill Hader. He's oh, also he is movie. in the movie. Uh, so there's a lot of good... Uh, well, he I'm takes a sure. shower in the movie. I'm excited. Ugh. Very excited. Uh, I'm going to vomit in my mouth. Bill but, Hader. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to the Chest movie. Chest coming. Uh, there's not a trailer. It does come out, I, I believe it's September 8th or 9th. Who cares? I just want to see a freaking orgy. There's like, not going to be an orgy. Give me my damn orgy. 
There's not going to be an orgy. and uh, It's unfair. If you're a true fan, you're going to ask for this damn orgy. Choo-choo. Choo-choo. It does come out on September 6, 2019. I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully, it comes out before then so I can enjoy that movie. All right, all right, all right. That's enough. enough, But I'm really excited for it, too. Um, I'm going to keep the whole theme going with the clown shit. Um, Okay, okay. One of my most anticipated movies of 2019 is Joker. I thought you were going to say Dumbo. Uh, (laughs) uh, uh, Dumbo does it cool, but no, Joker, they are reimagining the story of the Joker. Reimagining? Reimagining, right? It's a whole new shit, whole new universe. And Joaquin Phoenix. Joaquin Joaquin is going to be doing his portrayal of the Joker. And yes, how many portrayals, yes. How many portrayals have the Joker have they been already? Bro, I liked Jared Leto's. For some reason, people were hating on him. I don't think it's his I fault. Think I think producers the and <laughs> these execs uh, were impeding Jared Leto. But I like Jared Leto's uh, portrayal of the Joker. It was uh, punk rock, you know, acid trip. I liked it, man. Uh, but, you know, that couldn't continue. He's long gone. And I like Well, this. hell yeah, I would be too. I'd be pissed. We saw this quick clip of, of Joaquin doing his his uh, Joker. And I really liked it, man. I feel like he's going to bring a, a something cool to it. Um, I'm excited to see it. Uh, we don't really have a release date yet. We haven't gotten any trailers, but I mean, I'm excited, man. I want to see. I, I want to see what next this. next year. But you're telling me it's coming out this year. I didn't know. Yeah, what I'm hearing 2019, and trust me, I have my ears to the ground. I'm hearing rumblings, man. I'm hearing things. But I'm excited, man. I want to see what he, what he brings to the game, uh, and it's. I'm hoping it's a October release, you know, so it could be a nice little Halloween movie, man. Mm. But I am skeptical. I, you know, I'm not 100 percent sold, but I am. I am excited. I would hope so. I'm, it doesn't. It doesn't look interesting, but we'll see. So all right. To me now, the the Joker will always be Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill is the best Joker. Well, great. They just put great act- voice. Great they voice. They just put an actor to say the lines, and then Mark Hamill can just voice it. And Let's just put it. Mark Hamill in it. And, nah, Mark you know, Hamill paint, can't be the Joker. Get him naked and paint him. Um. All right. So before we get to our number ones, you have any honorable mentions you wanna you wanna honorable mentions? Hmm. Interesting. Um. Uh, yeah. Not not really. No? Okay. No, mine was going to for sure be uh, the Avengers movie. I'm excited for that. Uh, Spider-Man, uh, ah. you know, Far From Home. We did see a trailer for that. That is also man. one of my own honorable mentions. They let me down. But didn't make my top four or top five, whatever. They let they me down, man. Um, but my, uh, you want to go ahead and do your number one? Yes. So my number one, we touched it briefly, uh, was uh, it, comes out, <laughs> it comes out April 26th. Uh, of course, is Avengers Endgame. Uh, I'm really looking Endgame. forward to it yeah. to come out uh, after this super movie, hype. Yeah, after this movie, it's unknown of exactly who's gonna come back, uh, what movies are gonna be done. Uh, I mean, I, you know, if Robert Downey dies, if he leaves, I leave. Like Robert Downey is the daddy of these Marvel of this Marvel universe. I wouldn't say I feel like daddy. he's gonna die. I feel like they're gonna kill yeah, him. Yeah, I think I think him and Chris Evans are done with the movie. Nah, for a while. Captain America needs so, to stay. Yeah, Captain America needs to stay. I don't know what they're gonna do. Uh, it'll be interesting. Uh, up yeah, to it's this interesting point, to see what they're gonna. But do. But I really, I really hope they all come back. Captain Marvel's gonna lead to that. So it's interesting to see what they're gonna do with Captain Marvel and how that links to this. Yeah. To this new movie, obviously yeah. she's gonna be in Endgame. Obviously. Obviously. So, so I was at man. I, I mean, I'm excited, man. Uh, I'm excited. I feel like this is what everything's been building up to. Yeah. You know, fucking decades. And it's of three movies. hours long, and I don't mind. Yeah. We don't make care. it four hours. I still. Oh. I, I watched Lord of the Rings, the special edition, six hours each. All right. That's motherfucking eighteen hours. Twenty minute sexing. Give it to us. We want it. Uh, we demand it. Just watch porn. Oh. <laughs> oh, another one of my anticipated, uh, you know, movies, uh, porn, porn in general. In general. The, the, the parody? <laughs> the, the, porn, par- the parody. The parody of Star Wars, because it's probably going to be better than the actual Star Wars movie. Damn. J.J. Abrams is going to rescue Star Wars. All right, man. What's your number one? Jedi in real life. Um, okay, so my number one, I- I'm going to bring it to y'all. This is 10 out of 10. 100%. Go watch this movie. It's going to be movie of the year. Academy, Oscars. It's Detective Pikachu. Oh, my God. No. So you think Pikachu's good by himself. Now he's a fucking detective. Give it to me. Here's all my money. 
I'm super hyped about this movie. <sighs> Ryan Reynolds the needs to work on Deadpool. Trailers have been 30. super good. Trailers have been super they good. They have not been super good. The art is super good. The CG is super good. I cannot wait to see what what they do with this Detective Pikachu movie. It's going to make billions I'd rather, worldwide. I'd rather see a Metroid movie than a Detective Pikachu Please, movie. Please. No, no one can bring the personality like Pikachu and Ryan Reynolds can. No one can bring this to you. you this Ryan, is 10 out of Ryan 10. Ryan Reynolds never heard 100%. of Pikachu. 100%. You can't miss with this. Detective Pikachu, just look at the CGs, look at the trailers. This is my most hyped movie of the year. I cannot wait. I even got uh, I got the whole family coming. Buy tickets, a whole whole aisle. Let's get it. Let's get it in. I'm gonna get it in. Pikachu's gonna get it in. Everybody's gonna get it in. Gotta catch them all. Man, what is up with you on a lot of sex today? You horny or what? I want 10 minutes Pikachu sex scene. Give it to me. We all want it. With Charizard? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. You crossing the line. You're crossing the line, my man. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. These are our most anticipated. What is your number one? 2019. What is your uh, anticipated movie? All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Yeah, if you want to put porn movies, y'all feel free. You know what I'm saying? The more comments and links. And so please follow. Like, make sure you like, subscribe. Follow us on uh, twitch.com at uh, twitch.tv slash the three-way podcast. Uh, we'll be bringing live streams to you there. And uh, make sure you follow the Three Way Podcast on Twitter, uh, YouTube, uh, Spotify, uh, Apple Podcasts. Uh, look at our Facebook page. We got uh, the Three Way Podcast on there. Uh, We're so on we Anchor. Can, we can give you all the updates. Just uh, drip feed it to right into your veins. That's right. That's uh, right. But thank you guys for watching. We love y'all. Uh, comment. Let us know what y'all want to see next. We love you guys. Uh, if we get uh, uh, 10,000 subscribers, I'll fucking run naked on the streets. I said Woo! it right here. I said it right I'll now. Peace. It. Peace. I'll record it.